Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be comparing the Moyu Waylong WRM and WRM2020. So, as you can see by the first um, thing is reflection of the light, as you can see. Um, um, not a lot of light reflects on the, on the WRM2020. That means that the plastic is um, slippery. And yes, it is kind of slippery, but I use this cube for a little bit and it does get a little bit um, more grippier as you continue using it. But for the um, WRM, it's um, already grippy and um, good out of the box. That, so that's why I think that plastic wise, I think that the um, WRM is better because you don't have to use it a lot for it to be very grippy and good. And um, second thing, um, colors. So um, the green on the WRM is a little bit more, I guess, um, brighter than the um, green on the 2020. Um, the yellow looks a little bit more saturated than the one on WRM. I think that the blue, um, I think this one's a, l no, I think that they're both exactly the same. I think they look exactly the same. The red, this one's brighter, and the orange, um, this one's a little bit more saturated than this one. All right. So I already did some turns, but the corner cutting on the WRM2020 is over 45 and it mostly stops around here where that's where it can't corner cut on the WRM. Um, about the same. So um, yeah, it's about the same. Both of these cubes corner cut almost exactly the same. So, I think that um, both of these um, are good at corner cutting because they're both exactly the same on corner cutting. And speed, um, let me see. I think that the WRM is a little bit more faster because um, it's a little bit more broken in, but it is faster. And because I already put lube in this cube, this cube comes pre-lubed, but as you can see, it sounds very dry, loud. But this cube is faster, so um, on speed, the WRM is better. And uh, let's see. And just like usual, um, the customization is the same, except that the center caps are harder to remove on the WRM 2020. So there we go. Um, yep, exactly the same um, spring compression system. So let's just put on the center caps back. So um, the WRM 2020, the center caps are a little bit harder to remove. And on the WRM, um, it's easier. And on the WRM 2020, it's a little bit harder since I um, can't use one um, finger. I can use just one finger on this to remove this, as you can see here. There you go. And on this one, I struggle a little bit more. I have to use um, two fingers. There we go. So that's a little bit of a difference there. So piece design, let's go ahead and look at that if I can remove. Um, let's remove an edge if I can. Yeah, I think I don't think I can remove a piece. Yeah, I can't remove a piece because the tensions are um, somewhat tight. But on the um, WRM, 
I'd say, okay, on this one, yes, I can remove pieces. So the ten, the um, default tensions on the WRM2020 is a little bit more tighter. But either way, even if this cube is loosened a little bit, it wouldn't really make much of a difference since it already has the anti-pop mechanism. That means that even if you were to loosen it, it wouldn't pop. So, yeah. On the WRM2020, I think that um, it's a little bit um, shorter. I think it's smaller than the, than the WRM. Yep, uh, as you can see, it's a little bit smaller. I think this is 55.5 millimeters, and this is 56. So, um, on height, I think that the WRM is better. Since on the WRM 2020, it's a little bit smaller. And it's a little bit of a difference between both of them is this cube feels way bigger. But this cube is the normal size of a 3x3 which is 56 millimeters and this one's 55.5 but even if um it's just half of a millimeter of a difference i could still feel a difference it's not as big of a difference as one millimeter but i could still feel the difference that um both of the cubes are different sizes So price, I think that they are both exactly the same price, but I'm not sure about that. So um, I think that um, this cube was around thirty to thirty-five dollars, and that the um, WRM2020 was also thirty to thirty-five dollars. I'm not sure though. Um, but I'm gonna check once I'm done making this video. I'm gonna check the prices. And just like in the last comparison between the MS3 and the Tengen V2, I'm going to put in these two corners the final benefits at the end of the video. So, um, overall, um, better in general, I think that the WRM is better because the grippy plastic combined with its speed um, is really good. But with the WRM2020, the slippery plastic, it kind of... Um, makes me drop the cube a little bit more or maybe slow down because if I do my afterdens really fast um, I can um, lose track of what I'm doing since um, sometimes I would drop the cube um, but that's only when I'm doing solves and not now because I'm not turning in my fastest and concentrating a lot but I'd say that still the WRM is better anyway. Um, and final conclusion, I think that the WRM is way better because um, the center caps are easy to remove, even though that's nothing to the cube. Its speed is faster. The plastic is more grippier and better than on the WRM 2020. And I think that this can be a really good cube. I haven't really used this cube yet since I've only turned it um, for a while. I actually haven't done any solves on this cube yet. Um, but anyways, um, that's the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.